Hi everyone, welcome back to City Skyline. Today I'm taking a look at patch 1.1.1b. It released on Wednesday the 1st of July and we're going to just quickly run through some of the most important features. So starting off here, and as you'll see in the background, a feature that I'm trying to show off, um, there were 30 new buildings called growables added to the game. What this means is it's buildings that grow naturally, not ones that you plop down. So a growable, you simply zone some new space, and then there's a chance that in that new space, a new building, quote unquote, will grow instead of the old ones. Basically, it's a change in textures. So you'll see, um, I'm guessing, although we weren't given any specific information, but I'm guessing in particular, high density residential and high density commercial have probably received a fair amount of new growables. So here I'm just zoning a bunch of different types of land and seeing if I can grow some of the new buildings to show off for you. Um, secondly, in terms of new features, we have pedestrian tunnels, which are amazing. You'll see I'm adding one here. I'm going to add another one later as well. Um, I'm really stoked about this because I love pedestrian paths. I think it's just such a brilliant feature to remove away from traffic and congestion in your city. I think it's absolutely brilliant. Um, and so now we've got tunnels for pedestrians. Um, moving on, there are some new features available for modding as well. Uh, lots of bug fixes for the asset editor. So those of you who create assets in City Skyline will be very pleased with that. Um, and also in terms of uh, modding, there are, uh, is now a new feature where you can unsubscribe from all mods, which is going to be really handy. Uh, and it's also worth noting that if you're playing on the new patch, you should probably take advantage of that feature because... Uh, mods haven't been optimized for this patch yet, so please use that or you will screw up your game. Um, also, lots of bug fixes as well. Uh, a lot of the bugs most of us probably didn't even really realize existed, but they did. Um, two of the most important ones, for me at least, um, first of all, they fixed the trains getting stuck at map borders issue, which was a real issue. Trains were trying to leave your city, they were getting stuck, clogging up the railway lines. That's fixed now, and so it'll flow smoothly. Um, also, the random dezoned areas sometimes coming back and zoning themselves issue has been fixed now too. So that's it for this patch 1.1.1b. I'll link the full patch notes in the description below so you can check them out there. Thanks for watching, everybody.